Hello everyone. Today we are going to talk about the second aspect of design thinking and that is how to define a problem. Here as a facilitator you would have to collect all the data pertaining to the problem and share it with students. So say for example you're talking about water shortages, you know, or a shortage of safe drinking water for in the world. So you would have to then collect data on countries that have that are nearing zero day, data on countries that are on a water clean water surplus, data on waterborne diseases, sanitation problems, data on any of those. When you give this data vault or data folder that you create to children, they have to analyze that data and internalize it and then come out with solutions to it. So in a class that I recently conducted, um, we had many solutions that came out of this. One was, you know, the, the impact of using ROs in our households. So understanding water, understanding osmosis. Another team came out with bite-sized bottles, you know, they said that what if, what if, you know, you had a bubble of water surrounded, covered in a membrane that can be eaten. The, these children hadn't even seen caviar before. But they could still come out with it and of course there is some research happening around this as well because they said a lot of water in pet bottles is wasted because of this. Then of course somebody created a sensor that could detect dripping water, so water leakages and those kind of things. Children learnt from water systems to uh, you know uh, your regular rivers, seas, all of that, your water table, evaporation, condensation, salination, desalination, uh, so much was learned, so many concepts were learned with just one topic. And these, these concepts were across various subjects. So you can literally get each child to define or each team to define problems across different areas and domains and then see the magic unfold. So here is it and various techniques like, like mind mapping can be used in this and I will be talking about mind mapping in the next episode.